There we go, fix on. Don't want to take that one. Get a measurement on her and see how big she is. All right, she is 23 inches. All right, let's get her back in the water. So, in the state of Washington, you can retain one fish over 22 inches, but unless I gill hook a fish uh, by deep hooking it, um, I'm generally going to release most of my fish over 20 inches. That's because, statistically speaking, most 20 inch fish are likely to be older females and by releasing those we virtually guarantee that this fishery will continue to thrive it's been a really tough bite today though started off with um i had a couple of fish right off the bat on blade baits and i hooked and landed one and lost a couple and then uh, it was a long drought and i finally picked up uh, a fish on a jig and night crawler and Picked up a couple more uh, bites on the night crawler, but it sort of slowed down, so I switched back to something with a little more action, like this blade bait. There we go, fish on. Yeah, finally got one on the blade bait. Pretty far down there, 45 feet. Oof, that's a big girl. It's a big girl. Back down she goes. One netter. Okay, beautiful fish. There she's all. Calm down, girl. Nice thing about these rubberized nets is that your gear doesn't get hung up in them too bad. It's also really nice on the fish. Let's bring that big girl up here. Really nice 20, 22 inch fish. Oh, there, big girl. Get your teeth out of there. There you go. Get your teeth. Arr. Pretty fish. Look at that. Gorgeous. Man, that's a pretty fish. Alright, let's get her back in the water. I like to take home and put it in the frying pan. Awesome. 
Nice little eater. Got a little bit of barrow trauma because I brought him up pretty fast. You can see the eyes are bulging out a little bit. You gotta be careful with that on here. If you hook a big fish, I'll fight it slower. Just so I know that they'll burp the air and they can be released better. There's fish right there. First drop. Nice. Nice. Fish. A little bit of big one. Bring it up slow so we don't have barrel trauma. Nice fish. Nice fish. Look at that fat girl. Look at that belly on her. Healthy looking fish. Let's get her back in the water and we'll call it a day. Alright guys. The sun is setting fast and it is getting cold very quickly. So I'm gonna head back to the ramp and get my four eater fish packed away and get the kayak loaded and take off. I'll put links to all the products that I used in this video below. If you have any questions or comments, just let me know and be sure and hit that like button if you enjoyed this video. And I'll see you next time out on the water. Be safe, stay warm, catch lots of fish. See you guys.